My other camera is charging, so I'm going to shoot this without a tripod. Um, please forgive any shaky cam. This is a review of the um, Jetenuator. The attenuator that's um, provided, Soldano designed and provided by Jet City. Uh, in this demonstration, I will be using the Egnator Tweaker 88 amplifier and the Ditto Looper. Um, the first thing of importance to note is that the Jetenuator itself is not shielded. So when I have the um, Jetenuator on top of my amplifier, um, there is a lot of noise. So I'm trying to buffer it with a couple of laptops and a book, um, and it makes it a little bit better. Um, under ordinary circumstances, it's kind of on its own little tabletop and not actually sitting on top of the transformers and the, app, uh, and the amplifier. So um, just please forgive that. So let's talk about it first. Um, the Jetenuator um, has two knobs, one for the line level and uh, one for the attenuation. Um, it automatically attenuates at um, negative, uh, negative 3 decibels, so it cuts your sound by 3 decibels um, even at its loudest setting. Let's take a look at how I have it hooked up. The, the cool thing is that the um, attenuator itself has um, a mic sim, an output to your speaker, um, a line out that can be used to drive pedals, and then it has um, an input for 16, 18, or 4 ohms. Um, my amplifier actually supports all of them. So I've actually tried it out with um, each of those, and it works fairly well. So let's take a look at the attenuation as I turn on uh, my looper pedal. Again, the compression of the camera may prevent some of the dynamics from being heard, um, but I think you'll get the general idea. <laughs> So, the most dramatic attenuation, in my opinion, occurs between um, 2 and 0. For starters. Um, so that's actually really pretty cool. So there are two things that the um, attenuator does um, offer. And that actually is, um, it can operate as a load box. So I can actually pull the connector to my speaker cabinet when it's set at two and um, continue to use the uh, attenuator. So um, I've powered on my um, looper and as you can tell on my digital recorder um, I have two lines going. One of them actually is for the um, mic simulator, and the other one is for the um, line out. So let's hear the mic simulator. So that was line out. Mic sim the mic to me the mic simulator is a little bit darker, and the line out's a little bit brighter. So I actually record um, with both of them um, because I like the sound. To me, um, to me the. Um, sound of both of those together works very, very, very well. So overall, I'm very pleased with the way that the attenuator sounds and the way that it performs. And it's highly recommended as the one of the least expensive 
um, attenuators out there. And in terms of features, it's just phenomenal. Let me know if there are any questions. Thanks.